There we go. So, I thought I'd just get a little recap video of this weekend and also show you what I got in the mail. I ordered some stuff from this person I saw on Twitter, uh, Lauren Inc. She does enamel pins, stickers, and lanyards, and charms and stuff. All of her own stuff. It's uh, pretty fucking awesome, honestly. When I first saw the stickers and stuff like that, I was like, oh shit, I definitely gotta get some of these. They're melee inspired, so I was like, or Super Smash Brothers inspired, and I was like, fuck yeah, I gotta get those. Anyway, look at this packaging. I was like, oh shit, it's legit. Love the stamp and stuff. Let's dive right into this. So, you know, the only person I have to subscribe to on Twitch is Mango, and obviously I had to get the limited edition Mango W fucking <laughs> pin. It's a limited edition. I got the 91 and 100. It's crazy. Oh my god, I just love this so much. I don't want to, like, open it and actually use it, though. It's fucking crazy. Like, look at that. Oh, that's so fucking nice. Oh, the gold, too. Ooh. Also, just especially on the back. It looks really fucking cool. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna put it with the rest of my hat pins, but, like, I really don't want to fucking, oh, take this off. I definitely would keep the backing or whatever and just keep, like, the plate thing, I guess. Came with a little inside this. It's just fucking cool as shit. Alright. Let's go with these stickers. The first one. Ugh. This peach. Look at that leg. Ugh. <laughs> no way. Bitches get stitches? Oh my god. I fucking love this artwork so much. It's so fucking good. Um, yeah. Citrace fucks you up. I don't know, man. This is this was this was, like drawn so fucking well. I love it, and you know I had to do it to him. I had to get get one for the boy, Marth. Yeah, I might suck with him in Ultimate, but melee, crazy son. Melee Marth over the entire Ultimate cast. <laughs> Just the tip. Oh my god, I love this one so much too. The artwork is amazing. I love all the flowers and stuff. So. Now, I'm trying to put this on this laptop. Let's see what do we got. I, I I've saved this middle piece for this sticker for so fucking long. All right, that fits fucking perfectly. All right, now with this one. Um, I was thinking about moving this one down over here, like over this, but then again, I don't know. Cause I really don't care about this one that much. I might actually do this. That one, that looks pretty cool. Yeah, because you still see the NYU thing. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Maybe you want to see the WNYU over here, but I also don't want to block any of the constellation out. All right, so that's perfect. Okay, cool. A lot of these stickers, I guess I can I'll go over my stickers too, where they come from. I'll put these on in a second. So, this one is from the home base uh, skateboard shop in Bethlehem, where I also got my first skateboard and this second one, obviously home base. This is the Bethlehem, oh, sorry about all the mess, it's fucking, you know, New York wet and shit. I gotta clean it and definitely clean the bearings and stuff and the wheels and get new wheels, probably. But that is a backdrop of the um, steel stacks in Bethlehem, which is like kind of like the main like site point that you see beside like Martin Tower, but um, yeah, it's fucking crazy. I love it. Brought it with me to Sydney if you saw my Instagram post, it was cool. Bethlehem to Sydney with the home base post. Skateboarding in Sydney was definitely trash, but <clears throat> glad I'm in New York to come back and do this. I got let's see what so I got this sticker, this sticker, this sticker, this sticker, and this sticker in Sydney. That's for on the front. One, two, three, four, I got in the bar called um, Frankie's Pizza. I um, got these three all in one night. I just like peeled them from off the wall because like, you know, the wall's fucking covered in stickers and shit. So I got that and got them all. I like this, <laughs> the snail one, but I definitely like this one the most. It's just super cool. I wish, it was super hard to get off because it was like on paper, like on a paper thing in front of, on the bathroom sign. So it was like, it was hard to get off this and I kind of like fucked it up a little bit. So basically what I do is like, I 
take them off and if the, and I have a glue stick and I just glue up the back and I just attach it back onto this one. I also like this one a lot. Pretty cool. Uh huh. Same thing with like this one. This one like was peeling and whatever. Um, this sticker I got just on the booth, so it was like on wood, so it was easy to get off. This sticker I got when I was walking around in New York and near Chinatown, near where I live right now, and it was just on the wall of like a built like an abandoned building, and I was like, fuck, it looks cool, so I ripped that off a building. I ripped this off the side of um, Two Bros Pizza the one day when I was waiting to go to the mentorship with uh, GQ, and I just yomped that shit off the wall. It was pretty cool. This one I got in Cronella Beach. Um, we had done a big adventure, a big hike through the um, Royal National Park, and we were chilling. We, we was it was late at night, and we were chilling, and we got pizza. We stopped to get pizza and stuff, and then we started. We we walked a little bit to eat the pizza on the beach, and like on an electrical box thing, there was it was this on there. So I just yomped that too. This one I bought at Forbidden Planet, which is a comic book store near where I near um, Union Square. This one was from the, uh, well, this back one, this gray one, you can't really see it anymore, but it's a hologram. Jimmy Banta, my, you know, my best friend, he, um, he had an internship at, like, this hologram place, and Dr. Laser, the guy's name, actually, he gave me the sticker, but it mostly rubbed off, so kind of just, kind of just there for the memory. This one I got at the Boba thing, the Boba Squad, the show that we went, me, Alex, Jimmy, Zero went to. Got this one and this one at the radio show, radio station. I liked it a lot because I, I don't know, just, but you can definitely see the damage I pulled off for it, just kind of pulled it back and laid it out. Sometimes cleaning it works, but most of the time it really doesn't. But anyway, I also have silk on the back as well. Um, this one's, I don't know, I just like, these are the ones that are like branded ones I just kind of got. So this sketchy tank is, this one is this, this t-shirt that I'm wearing right now. I like it a lot. Um, this one, you know, ripping dip the little cat that sticks his middle finger up beats um this one i pulled off a like a traffic light thing when i was when we were walking the one day i don't remember what we were doing but i just like finer things this one the eddie thing um this one also from the boba squad beats i said this one i got in new zealand outside of the indian restaurant that we stopped when we were doing our six hour drive back to christchurch i just wanted a sticker I, and the girl mario was pretty cool but i didn't really care about the whole sticker visual itself i just wanted one that i could take these two i got when i was running in sydney near in um what the fuck's that tree called i can't remember sad but yeah we're underneath the highway i got these two stickers this one the fu fucking foot was so hard to take off i look i look pretty weird like on the side of a highway just like ripping off a sticker from the back of like a crosswalk sign so anyway let us let us put these on. I'll put the Marth one on first. Um, I'm gonna hope this this is filming me. Uh, let's do one of these. Nope. Okay, I'm just gonna assume it's filming me. It's a Marth. I'm so glad I got this finally. I was like, I finally had the money. I was finally back in the US and I was like, fuck, let's do it. But then the store was closed and it just reopened the 11th. I saw tweets about her closing again, probably for restocking because so many people were probably waiting like I was to get all this shit. I was trying to get this peach pin for, uh, for Corey. It looks so fucking nice, but it just, it was immediately sold out. And I, d I went there like the day right after the fucking store opened. So those, those fiends were on that shit. Yeah, this is taking, this is impossible to get off. You just gotta be super careful. I don't wanna bend the sticker already. All right, here we go. <laughs> um, Beautiful. All right. Okay. Ooh. I almost just fucked up. Damn, I would have been really mad if I did that. Okay. Alright, perfect. Make sure you get it even out. Press on all the edges, you know how it goes. Sticker talk, baby. 
Yeah, no. Um, I, I don't know if I'll do a recap because like this footage already is like almost like eight minutes long. I'll leave that for another day, or I'll just make a separate video. Look at the look at like the little thing. It looks super cool. Make a cool like tracing outline. Look at that. Looks like a, a chicken or something. All right, now this one. Man, I just ugh, looks so good. I would have gave this to you, Corey, but fuck that. <laughs> I want it. Here we go again, Jesus. Yeah, I'll leave the link in the description for the store so you can go support this uh, Lauren, the Lauren Inc. place. Yeah, I'll leave the uh, the link in the store in the description. Okay, what did I say I was gonna do? Oh yes, this. got a fold. Mm. Oh, beautiful. I also found some cool pin stores on Instagram when I followed Lauren. And I might buy some stuff from there because I saw some cool ones about like um, the Johto starters and stuff like that and some other and like a Bima one from Adventure Time, which I really want to get to for my hat. Okay. Yeah, but this is cool. I'll, I might actually just keep all this. I don't know why, but I will. Uh, anyway. Time for the pin and the hat. Here we go. I like the backs of these ones the most because, with these little rubber backs, because they like stay on the, the best. Um, yeah, I used to have this tonsil one, but I, uh, I broke it when I was at Devon's the one day. So I was tight about that. I might, I might do get it. I would put this one here, but every, every single pin, I would, I would put it here. But every single pin that I've had here has fucking fallen off, so I'm not doing that with this one. Um, it might be a dumb place to put it, but I'm putting it right up top. Everybody can see it, man. I don't know when I started doing this pin thing. It was probably like freshman year when I got the fucking hat. Um, I don't know why I just started doing it. It was a, I don't even know what pins I had at first. I mean, I definitely had pins and shit, but like this one I've had for Mad Long since high school. This one of my assistant band director from um, Liberty for Mad Long and shit too, but I don't know why I started the hat thing, but I definitely started it and it was a cool little like hobby thing to have uh, to collect pins. Ugh, I know it needs to go there, but I don't want to. Fuck it, I'm doing it. <laughs> it needs to. Or nah. I was thinking like maybe I could switch the place of these two. Actually, maybe. Yeah, I might do that because I really don't want to fucking lose it. Mango W. Yeah, go check out Mango on Twitch. He's super fucking funny. He's one of the greatest like melee players to have ever lived. He's switching to Smash uh, Ultimate. He's uh, he's gonna be in Summit, I think. Yeah, I've been subscribed to him for almost a year now. My nine month thing was like not too long ago. It's cool. His emotes and stuff are super cool. I also thought about subscribing to Nairo, but I don't know about that yet. All right, here we go. Yeah, that's a better lower position to put that in. Okay. Yeah, I usually mostly just watch Super Smash Brothers streamers and stuff. But I do like watching from fucking, whatchamacallit. Oh, Rocket League a lot on Twitch. Okay. So there we go. Yeah, that's better. Perfect. Yeah, I'll definitely worry about getting that BMO one. Oh, it looks so cool. I love that. All right, this video was actually much longer than I expected. Um, thank you for watching. Leave a like.
comment, and subscribe for more content like this, and also hit the bell button. See y'all later.